Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. Today is a big day because 2K has finally released a trailer for the creation suite for WWE 2K17, detailing create a superstar, create a moveset, create a video, create an arena, all that kind of stuff. So I'm gonna shut up real quick and let you watch the full trailer, but don't go anywhere after it's over because we are gonna talk about it. Honestly, don't even know where to start. It looks like they really, really updated the whole entire creation system. I mean, look at all the beards, all the different outfits, a bunch of layers you can use. They added in new uh, materials for the actual outfits. It really makes them pop a little more than they did last year. They don't look as flat. They look a little more 3D. Like, look at that outfit. It doesn't look like it's just painted on the person. It actually looks like he's wearing an actual attire. The face paint was upgraded. Really, really taking some big leaps forward here in the creation suite. I'm hoping the loading times have also been fixed a little bit. I, I definitely appreciate that. On to create a moveset, which obviously is everyone's, you know, usually everyone's just about favorite feature as far as creation goes. This year with all the extra move types they added in, look at this, you have you now have ringside finishers as well as in-ring finishers. So you can have completely different finishers whether you're inside the ring or outside the ring, which is an awesome addition. It really lets you, you know, switch up your play style, switch up your entire move set and have something uh, that's pretty unique and original. And it looks like they really went uh, kind of above and beyond adding in some new moves and some uh, some fresh, you know, additions. Unfortunately, create a finisher doesn't appear to be back this year, but, you know, hopefully with the advancements they made in other areas, no one will even really notice. Uh, on to create an arena. Now, I'm gonna be honest, I'm not gonna have a whole lot of time when this game comes out, so I'm really gonna need y'all, the, the awesome creators, to come up with the new Raw and SmackDown readings. And look at this, you can make a daytime or evening time when it's an open uh, stadium, that's awesome. I think having a daytime effect is really gonna add a whole new dimension uh, to the to the game and the gameplay because it's gonna look completely fresh and completely different than anything we've seen in the last couple of years. Uh, obviously, the same type of stuff you can add. You know, anything you want to the stage area, the ramp area, make whatever color you want. Now, this is where I'm gonna get real hype. Create a video, okay? In the article that came out alongside this trailer, which I will link below, you can pause the match at any time. At any time, go to the highlight reel, fast forward, reverse, change camera angles, pause it like almost exactly what I was praying for, for this highlight reel to be. And you can create your own Titantron or create a highlight reel. You can add effects, you can add logos, whatever you want. This is gonna make like creating a character just completely insane this year because you'll be able to have your own Titan Tron, add your own music in there like, oh my God, Danger is about to, <laughs> you're about to see a side of the Danger family you ain't never seen before. Create an entrance. I really dig the the font style and the uh, 
just kind of the, the layout of everything in this game. It's very clean, it's very crisp, it's not really blocky and bulky like the last couple years have been. I really, really dig that. So obviously creating an entrance is back as I'm sure we all assumed it would be, but I'm still hype about that highlight reel, man. That's gonna add such a, a, an amazing dimension for content creators to use this year. Not only to add stuff in the game, like I said, Titan Trons and all that kind of stuff, but you know, there's some really great content creators in the WWE uh, umbrella. Create a victory, also making a debut this year, so you can choose between uh, people's victories after you win a match. That's a feature that hasn't been around for a little while. Um, but like I was saying, a lot of great creators in the WWE, you know, YouTube universe, if you want to call it that. And I'm really excited to see what some of those guys come up with as well. Uh, I'm excited to use it myself, don't get me wrong. There's going to be a lot of awesome content as far as that goes. That's probably, out of everything they've shown, the highlight reel is by far the thing I'm most excited about. Like, uh, it's great that AJ and Bailey and all these people are in the game, that's awesome. But to me, highlight reel is, is the game changer. It really, really is. Because as a content creator, as a, you know, someone who tries to entertain you guys with content and videos, you know, just having an extra layer or having an extra feature to work with is gonna be huge. Create a championship, just like last year, seems kind of like the same, uh, the same deal. I don't know if they really added too much depth into this. But either way, it's a great feature to have because we're gonna need it <laughs> because I would assume the uh, Cruiserweight Championship and the Universal Championship, etc., are not currently in the game. And uh, it looks like they gave you a little more to work with as far as create a show goes with some logos and uh, some arena types. It really looks like they packed on the arenas this year too. I saw in there like Judgment Day 04 and stuff from like 05 and 06. So hopefully they really stacked that uh, arena universe so that we can kind of have a, a big array of stuff to choose from. And that wraps up the trailer, people. This, I'm gonna be 100% honest, just like I am with every time I talk about this game. This is the first thing that really hyped me up. Like all the stuff that they've come out with so far, the roster reveal and you know, other little features here and there. I was like, oh, that's really cool. Like it, this should be a step above, but this was the first time that I really said, yo, like this game is gonna be a huge, huge step forward. So let me know what you guys think about in the comment section below. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate your support. Hit that thumbs up button as hard as you possibly can and make sure you subscribe to the channel right freaking now so you don't miss any WWE or other awesome content. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon.